Hey folks, welcome back here to the Vegas Don channel. We're here off of A Street and uh, Washington Avenue here. Show you some of the uh, folks out here, the unsheltered folks out here, braving the elements. Out here along A Street and Washington. You have a lot of charities in this area, so a lot of folks just kind of hang out here all day. Right now, the temperature outside is about 115 degrees Fahrenheit. You have what looks like it was a former check station there for uh, commercial trucks. And uh, a lot of folks taking up residence here on the sidewalk out front. And they've cut a hole through the fence, so they go into that little structure there. And uh, a few steps away, you have an ad billboard up there for new homes. almost uh, an allegory for the uh, failure of the uh, capitalist society. I'm not getting into economics or socialism or any of that. I'm not uh, getting into ideology or politics. Just, you know, in the richest country in the world, it's just kind of sad to see these folks out here. There's Interstate 15 right there. That's a major uh, north-south arterial here throughout the western United States, running all the way from northeast of San Diego and east of LA, all the way up to the border with Canada. There at uh, Montana and Canada. This guy goes first because he is, has the right of way. And uh, going underneath the railroad overpass here, we got some more folks out here. On the sides of the road here. These folks are lined up here outside Salvation Army. Skyview Pines Apartments, there it says. Owens Senior Apartments. Street, Main Street, USA. I'm going to make a right onto Main Street. Show you the area here. Fertitta Community Assistance Center. We have a lot of charities in this area helping folks out. Lane. You see the shoes up there. Back in the 80s, that indicated this is a place where you can buy drugs. However, I don't know if that's still the same story now or what the story is. Very hot day out here. It's 115 degrees Fahrenheit. You can see the folks lined up here. And you got social services here, the social services building. Folks, here. This is where uh, Four Master was closed. Looks like the gate is open here, though. We're going to go ahead and make a U turn because we're not authorized to go through that exit. Go back westbound here on Four Master. some more of these folks here. As a country, in my humble opinion, we can do a lot better than this. And I know there are underlying causes for a lot of this, but um, in the richest country in the world, when we're able to give away billions of dollars to countries overseas and not spare any for our own folks here, yeah, they've got meals up here that they're giving out to folks. And a uh, ambulance coming in here. We'll make a left back here on the main street. Yeah, 
and this again just maybe a mile away from Fremont Street experience these multi-billion dollar casino hotel resorts down on uh, Fremont Street ironically with all sorts of rooms but um, not available for any of these folks Southbound on Main Street, Main Street, USA. We are uh, heading down towards downtown. There's Paiute Drive and the Paiute Indian Reservation right here, where they uh, have cannabis shops to help the uh, Paiutes make some money. I'm at a DOT over here on the left. Light at Washington Avenue, we'll go southbound through Washington. And wait for our turn here at Washington. We've got the green light now here at Washington, so we're going to proceed southbound on Main Street for our friends following along at home. Got a mural here, Justice, Equality, Diversion, uh, Diversity and Inclusion there. Save on Furniture, Salvadoreño Restaurant on the left there. And then the uh, you know, overpass for Interstate 11 slash Interstate 15 slash US 93 slash US, uh, US 95 coming into view here overhead. Bonanza Road now. Bonanza is a major east-west artery here on the east side of Las Vegas, as is Washington. They don't both go all the way out to the far west end of town. They end up getting cut off. But this is downtown Las Vegas here. Main Street Station, Circa. Fremont Street Experience starts at the Circa there and goes east about two or three blocks, three blocks, something like that. And uh, so which from the neighborhood we just came, you come on a few blocks south of it, and then you come down here into these multi-billion dollar casinos. The Grand there, Binion's. As we cross over Stewart Street there, in Stewart Avenue, there is Main Street uh, Station Casino. In the Ogden, and then you have the Garage Mahal there for Circa. And you have their uh, little pedestrian crosswalk there that goes over. And there's the Circa extending up into the Las Vegas sky. And then the Sam Boyd's California Hotel and Casino right there across the street from it. Golden Gate. Next line up ahead is at the Fremont Street Experience, which would be the western end of the experience. with the plaza located directly across Main Street from it. The plaza was featured in the film Back to the Future 2. It was Biff's Hotel and Casino, or Pl Biff's Pleasure Palace, I think was the name of it, something like that. If I'm wrong, please drop a comment in the comment section. But that was the facade that they used for uh, Back to the Future 2, I believe. there and pink box donuts Fremont Street experience here not a whole lot of pedestrian traffic out there right now it's because uh, when it's 115 degrees <laughs> you don't get a whole lot of folks trying to uh, be around outside make this left into the golden nugget we've seen on the weekends their parking rates are at about $50 for 24 hours Fifty five zero dollars US, <laughs> which is just wild. This is not a weekend right now. It's a weeknight. A weekend, a weeknight evening. Just curious what the sign will say out here. H2O there. 
Golden Nugget Rush Tower. And then we've got some pedestrians here. And then right now, now it's 25, right? Because it's not the weekend, so it's $25 to park here at the Golden Nugget for zero to 24 hours. <laughs> it used to be free. My goodness. Oh, times have changed. We go make a left here onto Bridger Avenue now. I'm not sure why everyone's yielding to each other here. And we're going to make a left back here on Casino Center Boulevard. And we got the green light here at Casino Center Boulevard, so we're going to make a left and go back northbound on Casino Center for those following along at home. And they've got some sort of outdoor amphitheater or something here, it looks like, with seating. Not sure what goes on there. Probably concerts and things of that nature as we come back up here to the light at Carson Avenue. Four Queens parking garage right there. Free valet and sub parking, but with validation only. Got the green light here, and now we'll watch the uh, light at Fremont Street Experience up here turn red. That's usually what happens to us. There it is. Just like clockwork. Here's the Golden Nugget on the left, and then you got Fort Queens Casino Hotel here on the right. And this is the pedestrian traffic up here for the Fremont Street Experience. You got Binion's over here on this corner. And then Fremont, Sam Boyd's Fremont Casino right there on the right. Golden Nugget up above the uh, barricade here that they use to cut it off when they have events in here and stuff. They'll cut off the traffic. Temperature still reads 115 degrees here in the shade. Someone crossing against the uh, crosswalk signal there. Got uh, bottled liquor, newsstand, binions. We're gonna make a right here on the Ogden Avenue. Binions parking garage over there. Again, free with validation. You got a brewery of some sort there. Respect the craft. Smoking good times, and then. Pizza Rock, so it, I, it might all be attached to Pizza Rock. Pizza Rock's very good. No one's ever paid me a dime to say anything, so these are all just my own personal opinions. These are uh, very good pizza places, pizza, Pizza Rock. There's one down in Henderson, too, at Green Valley Ranch Casino and Hotel. And uh, wait for these folks. And then we'll go up here to Las Vegas Boulevard and make a right. Shell Brazilian Waxing and Beauty Lounge, there it says. And now we are on Las Vegas Boulevard once again. This is the Strip, but it's not known as the Strip up here. That designation typically gets a sign up past the strap, which you see there in the distance. Here at this corner, we've got Heart Attack Grill, home of through over 350 pounds, eat for free. So if you're over 350 pounds, they have a scale out front. You can go out there and weigh yourself. And you eat for free if you're over 350 pounds. Hennessy's Tavern, very good place there. You've got uh, Inspire here on the left. Three floors, nightclub, rooftop, etc. Right there at the intersection of Fremont Street and Las Vegas Boulevard. As we continue southbound now on Las Vegas Boulevard. And Carson Avenue. We get a lot of folks with uh, comments asking if they should walk, if they can walk between Fremont Street Experience and... Las Vegas Strip. I, this is this this is the walk that you would have right now. It doesn't look so bad, but you come up here into some of these other areas, and they, uh, in my humble opinion, they tend to get a little sketchy. And I certainly wouldn't try that walk at night. It's 1.8 miles is the total distance, so um, I would uh, definitely recommend that you uh, Uber. They have the Deuce, which is the county bus. You can take that all the way down for 
I think it's like a eight bucks for twenty for a twenty four hour pass, or something like that. And then here, passing over Garces Avenue, we've got the Gold and Silver Pawn Shop here on the left, home of Rick Harrison and crew. I'm gonna make a U turn and go through their little uh, parking lot here. If the place is not nearly as big as it looks on TV, it's a lot smaller inside and out. right into here. Get a personal message from Rick Harrison. Oh, you went using Cameo. Yeah, they charge, so it's like a birthday thing. I've seen that. You can go on there and get some celebrity to say happy birthday to you. This is their shopping slash dining district here that they put across the parking lot from the Pawn Stars building itself. Some graffiti there. Um, and they're trying to you know, maximize, monetize as much as they can everything that they can. We're going to go ahead and park real quick here and say hi to everyone. Welcome to uh, the Vegas Don channel. If you haven't uh, liked, followed, subscribed, please do here on uh, YouTube and on TikTok. It helps recommend us to other viewers. I just wanted to show the uh, new gear that we've got here. Vegas Don merch available on the shop section of YouTube on uh, the YouTube tab there for the little shopping bag. We have some great cold weather, warm weather gear here, t-shirts, hoodies, Sweaters, things of that nature, with the uh, on Vegas Don logo on top of the Vegas uh, on top of the uh, Las Vegas skyline here. So uh, feel free to check those out. Hopefully, you find something in there you might like. Uh, thanks for joining, everyone, and always remember here on the Vegas Don channel, it's the journey. We'll see you next time.